<laughs> Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Grand Cross video, and today we're going to be going through the new Demon Manic Raid Boss, which is a new, uh, I, f I finished it so you know I can do it, and uh, it's pretty simple. It's literally just go in with a uh, full blue character, which is this team here. Um, everyone should have Demon Melee. And also Lilia, they were both given for free. Obviously, you have King for free because he is uh, guaranteed uh, like when you first do the story mode. And Elizabeth, most of us, once again, should have her. Uh, if you don't, I did just try using Harmers, which sort of worked, but I did actually lose. Uh, mainly because like, I just didn't get any heal cards. Uh, it, it, you can do with Harmers, it takes a bit more RNG. Plus, I didn't bring any food. And uh, yeah, it's it's very easy. But this team, it's just like, it's, you can go in, you clear it easily. Uh, I'm not going to bring any food, just to make it a little bit more challenging for myself. But overall, it is very easy. I guess the main thing to take away from this is the fact he has this skill uh, on his second phase where he increases his own if I was in the tier 2 right yeah okay both of them so increases own yeah so increases his own uh, attack and defense by 10% per buff on enemy obviously you are the enemy uh, so the only way he can get it on this team is if you have Elizabeth O off and he does actually get quite a lot of defense that's why you don't want to bring Derry and to be fair most blue characters in the game actually do focus on buffing like uh, my uh Eren, for example is another buff character diane you can use but i don't have a built up so there's no point of doing it now uh who else is it i mean murder's not your damage dealer but i think that's kind of like the, the two main ones that i would personally use i guess a red character will be these three here and they all buff up so like th there's no point i uh, just bring this team here and uh, it should be fine. Let's just jump in. Pretty straightforward. Um, especially the first turn. You just kind of kill him. Uh, you got to be careful a little bit. Uh, when you're doing damage towards the left and right, guys. By the way, the animation is so sick for this. It's a reindeer, of course. Okay, so if you kill the left and right, guys, they do... It does increase the main boss, the reindeer, Malak's uh, pierce rate. But to be fair, if you keep putting shields up, you should be fine. Plus, surprisingly enough, Elizabeth actually does do a lot of damage. Okay, so I'm just going to do this for the first time. There's no point saving for stuns because uh, you can't stun him. So just, just go ham and just send all your cards in. Okay, to be fair, it's not bad. So he does lower attack as well every turn. So you kind of want to have some cleanses. Which is why I'll bring King as well. Yes, yeah, so he's gonna wipe out the whole shield, right? Yeah, okay, almost. But yeah, pretty much no damage that turn. Corrosion does a lot of damage because he has a lot of HP. Uh, okay, so he's gonna use that skill, which is what, which was this one? It is this, right? So he's gonna increase his oh defense. Okay, yeah. So we kind of need to cleanse here because if we don't, then uh, he's gonna lower our defense because we have a debuff on. Uh, and then put up another shield. Get all as well, and it, okay, we have an extra skill. I've kind of forgot. Um, yeah, we'll just use that. Why not? Forty-one K, Elizabeth. Not bad. Like <laughs> she's kind of like the damage dealer right now. Okay, yeah. So I think I don't want to use. This, I don't think I even used the ult because we're gonna kill next turn. Actually, I'll use it now. Yeah, so that skill would have lowered our, our defense, I believe. And we lower it anyway because of our attack. Okay, I'm going to use this now. Okay, he's got ult, so I'm just going to do this. And then corrosion. So the reason why is because I think, what, the reflect lasts two turns. And then uh, I think by the time we go to the next stage, we should be fine. Because we don't want to give him attack. I mean, you, you can still do it in still one. Like, I did that the first time around. It's just you don't really want to do it. Okay, yeah, we're getting no pen cards, which is a little bit unfortunate for the run. But you can still see how easy it does go. Okay, nothing. Uh, reflect. Okay, well, if mine was 6-6, six, six, I might have killed it. <laughs> yeah, he's healing back the damage with the life still. Okay, so I think right now... We have no attack cards. That's great. Okay, I'll use this. Shield. What's his ult do? Oh, Pierce onto one enemy. Okay, we can eat that. Pierce won't break through the shield. And I'll rush Demon Valley's as well for next turn. Uh, yeah, okay, we'll do this. I think we might even kill. With Corrosion for next turn. Full health here. Uh, with Corrosion kill? 
I'm pretty sure you're gonna use a life sealed card. Yeah, he didn't break the shield. I'm with patience too, bro. My, my liver is too tanky. Corrosion. Oh no, I need a 5k. Okay, so this will kill. Okay, let's get started for the next turn. And, uh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, you don't really have to worry about. How do I. Do I okay, I'll move. I'll move kings. Don't really have to worry about removing ults, because you kind of kill too quick. So I think our buffs are gone now. Okay, so this is actually kind of cool animation. Yeah, bro, the boss that kind of looks sick. Okay, so now we have to be careful because uh, this skill here, the first skill he's using right now, the attack one, he does it uh, to increase his own attack. So the thing is, you can use a shield, which does count as a buff, but I think a tier 2 might actually be too much. But I think, does my, you know what, hang on, does my melee kill it? My melee might even kill. Oh, I used the wrong skill. Okay, so I'll attack lowered. Yeah, I meant to use the King Cleanse. Do we still kill? It's 6-6. Six, six. Okay, you know what? I think that might have killed you now. Oh my god, I'm going to get the worst skill for this run. Okay, if he breaks it, I don't believe he increases his uh, attack and defense. Oh. Okay. Yeah, you can see it didn't increase it. Okay, so now we have to cleanse again. Oh, once again, I'm not going to use the skill because we're going to get Reflect, which is going to count as a buff. Uh, Pepper Shield. Cleanse with that. Yeah, because then you can wipe out your whole team. Okay, Corrosion. Can we kill a King? He does revive us, which is a little bit annoying. But I'm just not getting pace cards. Like, literally, the whole game is just going to be uh, healing. Okay, there's the first pierce card. Okay, that's fine. Okay, yeah, so that's the thing. Now he he does that one corrosion skill, which he, when he deals damage with corrosion, he does heal it back as well. So once again, we can to cleanse that. Okay, I think we kill. I think my Elizabeth does the most damage. Uh, if we don't, do we get the murder as well? And then we should... Yeah, we're dead next turn. We still have a cleanse as well. There we go. Oh, we won't be kill now. Oh, okay, next turn, okay. And that's, it's, yeah, you can see how easy with this team. You can, Elizabeth Shield comes in clutch, not gonna lie. But you can see the run, this, this run went horrible because we didn't get like any real pace cards, so we couldn't kill. But to be fair, because of that, we didn't kill any of the left and right guys. So his pace rate is really low. Like, you can see how much damage he does here. To be fair, quite a lot. With no pierce rate. But then, yeah, we wipe out his whole team with uh, these two skills here. I don't have to cleanse, we still kill. And there we go, that's how easy it is. So, yeah, like I said, you could... No, I don't think you can, you know. I mean, you, if you want it, you could do it. You could replace Harmus for um, Elizabeth, but, like, it's... you got to rely on a lot of RNG, a lot of healing. Like, I almost did it, I got him down to his... Uh, the first revive, but after that, he kind of wiped out the whole team. Uh, but there we go. That is how to defeat the, the new uh, raid boss, Malik. Uh, very easy. Like, this team is almost free to play friendly because three of the characters are free. And you can argue Elizabeth as well is free since, well, she was guaranteed a 900. If you save properly, mine's only 1-6 as well. So, like, it's not even... You don't even use it all. It's literally just the, the damage. And plus, I mean, I have pretty, pretty good UR gear. Uh, I could sleep wake in both of these guys even more. Or all three of them to make it even a little bit more easier. But, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you helped out as well. And, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And peace.